creep on AZ. It's pretty good early. But Lin mostly plays triple hero. Mostly wants to get the Murloc camp with a one of lightning shield. I'm sure we're gonna yeah. see it here as well. Oh, and snare makes us a little bit suboptimal. This is already big because it is on happy side of the map and Lin creeps it, stealing this camp away. Especially in this matchup where it's so Late much. Master into war. TC into early Warmill. What is this by Lin? Does he bust out a new build against Undead as well? And Snare's coming. Happy still not level three. That's problematic. Late Master got that for the prolonged wind walk. More duration. Oh. Want to get in, want to get out, but Happy is quicker. Class plus nine. This lit is already a beast. So, and Snare is flying, going for the Fiends right away. Happy's close to the main. Could bring in the Ghouls if he wants to. No split at all against this Stomp. Surprising to see. Oh, the one of mana steal coming in big. That means the DK doesn't have mana for the next coil. And the Lich getting surrounded. Oh, wow. Has to transfer the TP to get him out of that situation. Lin is such a beast and he's showing it here. Happy playing a little with fire. If there's a critical strike, the Lich might die. But a nice early the engagement. counter expansion now, which is... Seemingly very late. Okay, goes for Temple of the Damned as well. Blade Master finds new targets. Once the level four and the Raiders come in. I wouldn't be too surprised if we have Pillage here. Keep happy busy. Don't let him unfold his play. That's the game. He and knows it now. Though. No, but that opens up the main and it's so many Raiders. Already, plus the Kodo for extra damage. The Slaughterhouse falls. Happy is already under so much pressure and seemingly has no answer yet. Lin playing this really smart. Really smart. Blade Master could go down south and look for the cancel. That's exactly what he's doing. Shade is trailing him. Good but guess what? Damage. That means the rest of the army in the main isn't being contested. And they're killing more buildings. Last Sniping some Acolytes here could be very beneficial to him. Lich's damage is... No joke. Plus no. 26. Plus 26 damage. How often have we yeah. seen a Lynch being the carry? And now Lynn goes for Invul and Heal series. Ball. We do have Nova now as well. Good control. The TC. Here are the splits by Happy. This is exactly what, you, what we meant before. TC finds two targets now, but it's way better than in the previous engagement. An instant kill as well. Another Fiend might fall, but the Raider. Oh, Heal Scroll. Very nice by Lynn. It for another angle to attack. To use the Stomp on. There we go, double disable on the heroes again. Lots of piercing damage now against these destroyers. They're getting ensnared and one of them is certainly going to fall here pretty quickly. Happy not going for the heroes at all, losing all of his army in the process as it seems. Only the DK and Lich are left. No ensnare to control them anymore. But level 4 for the Blade Master. More damage now from him as well. It looks like Lin has hit a really good timing, yes. which Happy just wasn't ready for yet. No tower at all, no ziggurat, no slow. What? Can Happy do? He was in a desperate situation against TH already. He needs exactly that now. Double Kodo, Wyvern even, the Headhunters. The TC still has mana left and he stuns both again. The Blade Master comes in with a backstab and Happy loses his damage dealer. This seems to be game already. Lin continues his dominance that he had throughout the entire tournament. Wow. Echo Isles goes to the Korean. Blade Master bought the slippers, which is pretty nice. Oh my god. Lich stealing is going to be happy with these items. And stealing the Claw plus 9 away from the blade is a big deal. This can spiral completely out of control with Critical Strike later. Then this item would do like 36 damage on his own. That's not a Claw. No, could be a Pendant, but I'm not too sure of the Chinese item name. In a region again, it seems. Okay, that's very good for a Blade Master early, but... Oh! Didn't uh, get it. I'm not sure who got it, actually. Oh, it's, it's quite a bit of damage on the uh, experience on the DK. And damage on the DK. He bought another Claws of Attack. And the Grunt is falling. Yep, that one's gone. Never lose a Grunt in the early game. Question is, is the Fiend going to be traded for this? He should have grunt another block. Core, maybe. Oh, nice sidestep by Happy anticipating this. There's another Grunt coming in. Happy has a Coil. Is it still enough, though? It's only level 1 Coil. Using the speed scroll for it. Okay. The aura is, of course, helping a little, but the damage should be enough. Critical strike Great. as well. Here comes the fiend, but not enough to block. Right yeah. away. But that is 30 supply expansion. Yeah, and that's, what is that, like 500 gold being spent. Whoa, this is ultra greedy. Yeah. It's like Happy might not expect this. If oh. this goes unpunished. A creep jack at the 
marketplace could buy him the time for the expo. Reveal. Oh, big reveal. Wow. Really big reveal. Happy with the star senses. Not starting this. Plate Master down to 50% with the Ring of Regen. A lot of run buys. Oh, if the altar falls, that means no third hero. Spirit Tower finishing up. No repair at all. Shadowhunter doesn't have level 2 here, Wave. No Only level 1. No TP yet. Okay. Prioritizes the creeping. Ring plus 4. Which is level 2. That was a big one. Oh. Shop gonna be falling as well. That, that means, means no statues. No statues indeed. He prevents the repair with an snare. And again, two buildings down oh, in happy a, It's space. a cancel though. But exactly. He finds it. And that means Great Hall denied. With Lin being at 41 supply. Quite some damage in the main was taken as well. Two raiders soup below. Grunts are falling. Uh, ghouls are falling for it. Coil invested, but saves it. Quick Hands reactions on multiple screens. But if Happy doesn't have to use the TP here to keep his base safe, this is really good for him. This game plan for Lin was distract and get the expansion in the main, of course. Maybe Jesus Christ, that is yes. Christ. Plus 24 and two gloves of haste. He kind of needs a Dark Ranger to make use of these items. Or Wait a minute. Frenzy Ghouls! I oh talked to him about Frenzy Ghouls! Okay, four Frenzy Ghouls coming in. The Nova doesn't connect and speed scroll out. Can he get a Sedona or something nice and snares to disable them? They can be as fast as they want. If they're under a net, they don't move. The best counter to ghouls, of course, a is a little bit of a surprise if we didn't check the inventory, which we definitely should. We do have damage mitigation with Curse. Must be applied on the Blade Master immediately. And here's the one of the win. No healing for Happy right now. Kodo gets the Devourer off there on one Fiend as well. That was pretty nice. Happy aiming for the heroes now next. The Shadowhunter in a bit of trouble. Blade Master getting slept, but Lin is finding a really good fight. But now the focus is coming in. But the, or uh, the TP was still there. And with that, the Orc army disappears. There was two charges of the one of the wind. One still remaining for that one clutch. Got level four. Big level two crit. The damage, he doesn't, doesn't stack the damage too high. Plus seven, plus 12 only with the orb. And we have our next best, uh, next big fight coming in. Disables the Blade Master. Lichful mana, looking for the big Nova. Kodo could be a decent target. Or what's he going for? Berserkers instead. Okay, the ghouls do crazy damage to raiders and berserkers. Two banshees split, but the lich is under pressure. Here's the one of the wind again, and the lich seems naked. The lich is dead again. The damage dealer's taken up, but they're fighting close to the tavern. Can he buy him back? Level three, super expensive. He needs to get this lich back, otherwise there's no control. Yeah, absolutely. Necessary buyback here of the Lich Happy. Did he get him? I don't think so. Yes, he did. Otherwise, ah. it would be grayed yeah. out. Yeah. He is back but at 50%. No disable anymore from the wand. The banches are about to fall. Supply is still quite equal. This Lich, man, you cannot measure him in gold nor supply. What this Lich is lifting is absolutely Shadow crazy. Hunter? Is it Surrounded. a surround? Sleep applied. But now he wakes him up. The ghouls are about to fall, but the Shadow Hunter falls nonetheless. And now Lin is in trouble. Now Lin has no healing. Now Lin has no disable. Oh, sorry, Stomp, of course, but only limited. That was the last one. This gun's going to fall as well. Lin still with a supply lead. Still an upkeep. Engages still again. The TC still not level 3. Far away. Is he really going to try without the Shadow Hunter? That looks very scary. Okay, he's going for it. More and more ghouls coming in. Lin seemingly has no answer to them yet. Nova hits big, and Lin is losing more of his ant snares. How does he want to disable this uh, undead army? Satsu getting taken out. Blade Master might be in a bit of trouble, though. Has to be careful. No invul for him anymore. No invul anywhere. Oh, excuse me. The DK actually has one. But these Frenzy Ghouls, they're tearing through the back line. TC doesn't have the stomps anymore, and Happy is winning this fight. We have another statue coming in. By the way, we go Carrion Swarm, not Aura. Interesting choice, but might come in as a surprise during a nuke. Lin might expect Coil Nova, but does he expect Coil Nova Carrion Swarm? Probably not. Lin was trying to hold the expansion, trying to buy time for the Shadow Hunter. Doesn't he work. Should be back kind of soon. And we have that big fight. The Storm was really good this time. Can he get that follow-up? Number of headhunters not too impressive. The Carrion Storm is going for the Shadow Hunter. Has to heal himself. This is not too much mana on him anymore. Two more and no hex with this pool, but oh my god, look at this AoE! He just wiped out almost the entire backline, but what about the front row? Can he control the TC and the Blade Master? He's just aiming for the healer. Is there another nuke? He has a lot of mana on the DK. Shadowhunter out of the fight. Lots of kills here going both ways. Lich level 4, DK close to 5. This would make these heroes even scarier. DK so much mana, by the way.
So many coils still available for Nuke. Doesn't want to use it aggressively, I guess. Only for the defense. Shadowhunter is coming in with the clarity. Could nuke him right away. There is... Nova oh! Cannon to Coil, but the level up and the heal wave. These will follow up. There is oh, speed scroll speed coming scroll. in. Needs another long range coil, but backs off. Shadowhunter again out of the fight. The next coil needs to be used on the Dreadlord, but he barely misses the DK with the storm. That could have been it. Now more control on the Blade Master, but woken up immediately. Sleep doesn't work against Lin. He's just too good. More coils are available. DK very close to five. Same is the case for the Blade Master. Shadow coming in on low HP again. This is dangerous. Oh, the storm by the Dread Lord. He needs another coil. Is he in time? Oh! Yes, he is. Last second coil. Oh, my God. Lich is still doing crazy damage. The next walker is falling. Blade Master levels up to level five. Critical strike level three coming in. The Dreadlord is the target. The Lich! Oh my god! Leaks the anvil oh. once again! 10 HP and the chase and the Shadow Hunters once again there. How much mana is this still left for the DK? A lot! And he saves that Lich again before the anvil wears off. 39 versus 39 supply. This is as close as it gets. 260 crits. Gonna take out the statue as well. The Lich almost fell. He eats the ghoul, gets the mana, has the Nova. But the Blade Master back into the shadows. Invul, extremely important. Should be able to get all, it on the Blade Master. But he got the Invul extra is on cooldown. mining. Well, it's on cooldown right here. Uh oh, reveal. Uh -oh. Nova oh, and sleep. sleep can't get out of that one. Needs the ghoul. Nova ready. Blade Master dead. Boo! Didn't remember about the invul cooldown. Uh, one and missed. no heal cells either. He's gonna be yeah. using one of his few heal waves. GG. GG. That's about it. Happy ties up the series. This was exactly what I was hoping for. Seeing this match on paper. Again, the normal Ted Fiend opening. DK is here. Almost walking into the round. Yeah, right that was real close. Slowing Lin down, trading a couple of hits. Oh, the grunt? Oh, I think he got that. And again, how does he want to play around the coil now? Oh, wait, that's a surround right here. Yeah, but he's in there. Lin is getting slowed down a lot. This is so annoying for Lin now. Skeletons are ready again. Can summon more. Oh. Lin gets it both. Yeah. Why didn't Happy coil that? Sorry. And stealing one of the biggest items. Oh. Speed scroll. Looking yeah. for a fiend kill here, perhaps. That is definitely going to be one fiend kill. Can the or DK is arrive? The oh. run block is not perfect. Now the unholy aura is there and the coil. Unlike on Northern Isles, this is two uh, more or less healthy fiends. Is the DK gonna look for the run down here? Might be able to kill one of the grunts. Oh, go for the slaughterhouse first, delays the statues. Uh, walks into the slow range, that's a little bit. Uh oh, dangerous, has to pop the big end wolf. That was a little unnecessary, I feel. Is it worth it trading the big invul? You have to get a fiend with it as well, right? Uh-oh. I think it's the lich timing that surprised him there. If he doesn't go for the invul, the nova is going to kill him. Yeah. But happy decides to go for frost armor. More How reliable How does happy way? see this? Is yeah. the question. He is on the middle of the map. Just got his third hero. He sees it now. Can he repair? Oh, TP immediately. Scroll of the beast, though. There's no dispel against that. Hex on the Acolyte to actually prevent this. Oh, heal wave. This is a lot of damage, but I guess Lin is forced to retreat. No, he's going full through with this. He will get the haunted, which is dead. Wait, wait, there's no TP. Oh, there is. Oh, sorry. Just was used already. A lot closer to Echo Isles. With the addition of the Zeppelin drop and the Book of the Dead, and that's the statue for free. Happy is trying to get every unit together that he can, but. Uh, actually. Okay, the skeletons take it out. Nova to engage with the Pit Lord. Got the w at the end of the day. He's preparing the bottom left already. Maybe for another Great Hall. Yeah, setting up a shop there when it finishes. Goes for the next time. Okay. Then is going for that fight and happy. Oh, that dodge was great. He did barely hit anything, only the Lich. It's a weird timing for Lin to start this fight. Kodo has not eaten heavy damage on it, though. Lich a little exposed, so is the Shadow Hunter, the target of game two. The Raiders, they take out the expansion. And that's the most important kill here. Statue's, Statue's being taken out as well. 
More damage. He got the web, but no repair by Happy. He seems a little overwhelmed. And all the end snares. All the end snares preventing the repair now. And what did he lose again? It doesn't feel like much. Still at 65. I wouldn't be surprised if he actually didn't lose anything. Happy's mining interrupted once again. Blade Master close to level 4. Lin is playing cat and mouse with Happy. Chat under also so much mass left, so much healing still to be done. Happy, barely any units remaining. Kono's gonna fall. That's a big deal, actually. And Lin's losses are starting to accumulate. Maybe it's time to TP out of this pretty soon. Another rate of falls. Coil arrives in time. Now the walkers with the spirit link. Big upgrade. There's also a lot of coils left for the DK. Yep. Like healing still looking good on both sides. Finally, Banshee's coming back in again. That one needs to apply the curse. But look how he's ensnaring the Banshee, not letting her into range of the Blade yeah. Master. Really smart. This control, this positioning of the Blade. And now he cuts through the Fiends like crazy statue again. And snared everything that joins the fight is getting ensnared. And the heroes are picking it off. Lin with a masterclass game of Org versus Undead here, getting further and further ahead. Happy down to 34 supply only. It's the heroes, really, not much else that is left. All started with the snipe of the Haunted Goldmine. It's so impressive. It's so impressive how he finds this this opening against Happy. And okay, this Pit Lord, <laughs> despite all the rings, will fall. And that means no howl. He's dropping so hard on supply, and that's match points for Lin! He's been so close once in 2016, and he's just one map away from finally accomplishing this dream of a gold league win. Do you want to go that far away from your original game plan? Quite some questions. Uh, okay, he knows. Just have you get this around. This would be a big one. Oh, it doesn't look too good. Can't get in front. Uh, now the DK. But Blade Master's close by. He can pop him out. Yeah. But he's quite hurt. Still got block. There we go. Two grunts here. Late Master seems like doesn't want to commit. Has an invul. Ooh, I don't know if that's too good for Happy. Okay. But he falls back. Cost the DK, however, a lot of health fight. and mana. Yeah. He doesn't. W he does not want to fight. Oh, DK coil. Oh, did he get it? Not sure. Yeah, I think so. TC did yeah. not get it. What is it, Raider into Wyvern transition? It's really tough to say. Happy sees the need for aggression. Wants to keep the TC low, but he, okay. At the moment, no storm. So he can predict pretty much everything except the crit. Okay, pretty low HP. This ensnare is probably gonna trigger a TP. Happy slips once. Lin is the world champion. Speed scroll. Oh, a little indecisive again. Waiting for the end snare. Plate Master is in the best position possible. We're just waiting for it. Is it flying? On the lich. Okay, there is Frost Armor. Anti surround. Gets him out of there. Nicely done without the TP. But it's forced oh. to a coil Ooh, soon. Close. I guess he's trying to dance out of it. And so far Second it's working. But for how long? Yeah, I can't get out anymore. Happy triggering some good items, but he can't prevent the TP for so long! What? The coil! It was too greedy! Not going for the TP was the mistake! The first hero is down, and we said it! It's all about mistakes! And that's the second one! Double hero kill for Lin June Park on the way to his first gold league! He must have been smashing that TP button, but it wasn't in time! And with that now... Uh Painful, painful deficit, and oh, Happy walking into the creeps as well. More What's mistakes. happening? Happy is completely overwhelmed. He lost his calm, he lost his concentration, and he is about to lose his world championship. If the altar falls, knowledge coming back, that's another catastrophe. Mass repair, but Ensnare is there. Ensnare disables it, stomp against it. There's no way to get this Lich back. At the moment, he gets a Raider okay, but that doesn't do too much. TC. Oh, surround, happy, fighting like crazy. He has a big interval, pops him out with the blade. Is he overconfident? No. Lin, pretty much flawless. As he was throughout the entire tournament. Pretty much flawless.
Expo on the way. Hero this. Level okay, attack. this is quite a Hail Mary already. Needs to get this done to keep his the smallest chance alive. He needs to get this, but there's an snare. There is Storm. Not, not using enough damage. it yet. It's not enough damage. Not using it yet. Oh, this is so, so close. He's losing everything. And he's about to lose the DK as well. But yeah, you're right. It's not oh, enough. He's supposed to leave. He's still no Nova. How do you want to kill, to kill heroes without the Nova? DK, Lin going for the throat, going for the championship. Here comes the stun. Four seconds, there's no invul, there's no TP, there is no DK, and there is absolutely no hope left for Happy. Again, this looks like Groundhog Day. The DK falls, the Lin's in trouble, the end snares, the arrows raining on that second hero, and Happy is playing StarCraft again. GG, the new world champion, the last Frozen Throne world champion, after a three-year drought, is Lin. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,